Welcome to the Landscape Library's YouTube channel. I'm Jordan, founder of the Landscape Library and voice behind the tutorials. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel and visit our website, thelandscapelibrary.com, to read landscape-focused articles or enroll in our online courses teaching the top softwares for landscape design. If you have questions or comments, add them below and enjoy the video. In this tutorial, I'm gonna show you how to use the command extrude surface along curve. And this is very useful if you have maybe a unique shape that you want to be extruded or create a surface along a unique path. For example, let's say you had an irregular bed shape with a polyline connecting to a house. Maybe that this was um, this was the house. Let's trim this line right here. Move this over. Let's say you wanted all of this as just a square curb. Um, and that's different from the pipe command. For example, if you wanted to just pipe this, uh, pipe this curve, we could by doing um, a very simple curve. You could see that there's a little bit of overlap that we would need to clean up. But let's say we wanted there to be this like six inch concrete curb. So let's start by using the um, rectangle command and in plan view or in the front view let's draw this just real quick we have a curb and this could be whatever dimension you'd like obviously all designs are different but let's say we wanted this to be this curve to have a extruded surface so I'm going to use extrude surface along curve I'm going to select the surface Press enter when done, and I'm going to select the curve. You can see that now it quickly generates a, uh, a curve or a surface along the curve. There would be a little bit of cleaning up that you would have to do along the curve. For example, right here, it looks like maybe that there's just a, a small area that's a triangle that you would just have to clean up, but it is um, very quick to develop those curves rather than maybe individually drawing these boxes, rotating them, or um, maybe ex offsetting the lines, joining them as planar surfaces, and then extruding up. Like I said, there's always different ways to do something. You just have to learn which is the fastest way. And when you become you know, proficient in the program, you're gonna immediately recognize which is the best way. For example, another way is, let's say if we wanted this curved bed line to, um, we could start this with, let's say it is a unique shape of interpret curve. Maybe this is unique shape. I'm just gonna finish the line here. I'm gonna join these curves together. So it's, it's one curve. And I wanna make this as a planar surface because this is what we'll want to copy along the curve. So we're gonna do extrude surface along curve. We're gonna select the surface, right click, select the curve. And now we have this unique shape along the edge of the curve. There's gonna be a little bit of cleaning up that we would have to do along each side but this is how we um, can quickly create unique shapes along a curve.